Welcome to the Eric Kamadeka Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with Eric Kamadeka, head coach of the indoor, well, and outdoor track and field teams, but we're talking about indoor now. And, Coach, it's been a while since you guys have competed. It's only your second meet of the of the year. Teams have had a lot of time off. What are you looking into this meet? I'm trying to see who's in shape, who's not in shape. You know, we've had almost two and a half weeks off before the new year where they were home and we had to trust that they did everything. Now we're getting back. We had a good about 10 days of practice since they've been back. And so we're just excited to see where everyone's at. And in the first meet, you got a lot of qualifiers all already for the ECACs and a national ranking out of it, too. Talk a little bit about that team. Yeah, so um, like I said, we came out of there with a lot of top 25 performances. You know, some of those performances are still holding up after a couple of weeks of competition. Um, you know, we still have a couple top fives, number ones. And then the really crazy thing for us is that I found out when I was at convention that our men's 4x2 team is not only the top team in Division three, but across all divisions, Division one, two, and three. That's one uh, accolade to hold on yeah, to. That's yeah, pretty absolutely. impressive. Absolutely. What are you looking into as far as personal or event group uh, performances into this meet at the Armory? Uh, so, you know, I'm really looking forward to the women's shot put. Danica and Jess Riga are going to be really just focusing on the shot put this weekend. So give them some time where, you know, not the entire team is there. They kind of have time to focus on themselves and really go after some big performances. Um, in the jumps, you know, uh, Kenneth Scott Kilo is making his return from the football season. He's going to open up in the triple jump, or I'm sorry, in the long jump this weekend. Uh, you know, hopefully we'll see. Obviously, he'll qualify for conferences in his first jump. We'll see if we can get that ECAC qualifier out the way. Um, Adam DiBagati is going to open up in the triple jump and just focus on the triple jump this weekend. Uh, and then we have Steven Sneed who's going to kind of tackle all three jumps in the long, the triple, and the high jump. Well, Coach, we'll be looking forward to all those uh, competitions, and it's a historic venue for you guys. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, if anyone has ever been at the new, the Armory in New York, it is just one of those places you you have to see if you have not been there. I mean, the environment is just – it's incredible. You know, it's almost like an old theater, and then the track is down there in the bottom, and everyone's sitting up above you, so it's a really cool atmosphere to be in. Well, we'll be looking forward to it, and good luck in getting some solid results out of this weekend. Great. Thank you. He's Eric Kamadeka. I'm Joe Wamba, and this has been the Eric Kamadeka Show.